to tell over your children, sons, daughters, and to speak about the Sipur Yisiat Mitzrayim. Even if they don't understand how to ask, teach them whatever they can understand. Whatever they can understand, you're obligated to teach. It's not only a mitzvah for your son. That means if a person doesn't have children, he also has the mitzvah. You have a mitzvah with every single person in the world. And therefore, as long as there's somebody else there, you definitely have the mitzvah. And even if not, you still have a mitzvah to talk about it. It's only that your son is first on the list. The first one that you should be talking to is your own children. And this is, of course, very difficult when you're at a large crowd, when you're going to other people's homes. Many times, the children end up on a totally different table. They end up not being with you, and there's only an adult table. That's no good. It's not the right way. Having just an adult table is incorrect, because the mitzvah of the night is to speak to your children. And therefore, each parent should take his own children and sit down and talk to them. Because that is the ikara mitzvah. Not that you're not yotze anything if you had just an adult table. It's also a mitzvah. But that's not the ikara of the night. The main part of the mitzvah is for your children. Lehagid de bincha, to tell your children. And he says, if you don't have any children that you have what to tell them because already they know whatever. So a person has the next step, which is he can tell his grandchildren. He can tell his your grandchildren also count. And therefore, each parent, each grandparent, is obligated to speak about Sipuri Yisiat Mitzrayim. It's not, we already said it, they already know everything. No such thing. That what that is a mitzvah, it's a, it's a mitzvah de oraita, to sit and speak to your own children, to your own wife, to your own grandchildren, and therefore take the time, try to make sure that the children and the grandchildren that you're coming with, many times should sit next to you, at least during the Magid, even if it's not the whole meal, even if it's not during the eating or whatever, but at least for the Magid part of the Haggadah, each parent should take his children and make sure they sit next to him in order to be Mekayem the Mizvah Doraita.